Hi, this is Barrett from rhinestonealphabets.com, and I'm going to walk you really quick through the steps to create an outline like this around the RA double block small font. It's really easy to do. It adds a lot of bling. I've used it a lot. Customers love the look. So what I'm going to do is um, move down here and if you look at, if you highlight this you can see this is a typed word and open your font box it's called the RA double block small font and it is sized at a 2 and that's the correct size for an SS10 stone really easy to do once you have your word typed again I typed L-I-O-N-S only I do it did it in capital letters, L-I-O-N-S. Once you have your word typed, you can go into text, visual spacing, and you can space this. Now if you're going to add an outline, go ahead and put a little space in between each of these uh, letters so that uh, your outline doesn't bump up against the each the letter before it and then you hit this to erase that text um, spacing tool so now we have a design that's almost six inches and be aware that when you add the stone on both sides you're going to add about an inch to this design but let's take it a step at a time what you're going to do is um, you're going to go into tools, outline, and outline should be 0.11 for thickness, and outline should be checked, and then hit that yellow check button. Once this uh, is outlined, now it's outlined, go up to text, break your text from the outline, and touch one of those circles and pull your text out now. Now you're left with um, the word lions and I want you to go into wireframe here and you're going to see that there's a few oddball circles in there. So I want you to grab that S, go to tools, weld, get rid of that and then grab to make sure that you have no weird little dots in that design. Now, what you're going to do with this is you're going to highlight it, open up your rhinestone transformation tool, and up here you're going to go to 13.126 and .035, plug in that data if it's not there, and uncheck erase original because what you want to happen here when you apply you want these circles to go right around the lines you want to be able to see the lines so that uh, before you erase the lines you can make sure you've got these spaced properly now if we look right here we see that uh, there's a little bit of overlap here so probably we should have added a little more spacing between these letters in the beginning. But for a time constraint here, what I'm going to do is just um, two options if you run into this problem. You can either just make it one outline or you can pull it in a little bit uh, like that and then go to edit, duplicate, circle and you're going to duplicate and then make sure you've got enough circles in there and again you're going to do that with each of these to make it um, the way you want it and once you're done highlight the line and delete and now all you have left are those little circles and um, it should fit perfectly around your L so let's go down, let's find that L again. And uh, there is our word. Let's add a little color to it. Make sure there's no outline. Uh, let's 
let's take away the outline here because you don't want to send it to the color the cutter with two colors in there with the outline and uh, otherwise it um, the cutter wants to read that there's more than one color there that you're cutting so again there it is you got it set ready to go again let's add a little bit of a rhinestone color to that so you can see how that's going to look and the final thing you might want to do is if you're making a template picture for your customer go ahead and grab your word Let's move it out of here and hit the tr rhinestone transformation tool with whatever color rhinestone you're going to use. Now in this case, let's break that. All right. So there you go. And uh, let's put that on it so you can kind of see what that's going to look like. So that's all there is to it. You just go letter by letter, and um, I'm going to upload this. And uh, if you need a little more help, no problem. So we'll uh, we'll take care of you. Thanks. Bye.